If you've suffered from chronic neck and back pain for years, now is really finally the time to get relief in a natural way. We have invited our expert in relieving pain, Dr. Christopher Miller here, to talk to us about options to relieve pain. And today, I just really want to ask you about sciatica. That's a, a term that you hear a lot. Exactly what does that mean? Yeah, Terry, a lot of people have heard the term sciatica, or some have even struggled with that. And I think many know it has something to do with leg pain. Um, but sciatica is actually more of a different group of symptoms than an actual diagnosis. And what I mean by that is there's actually five different nerve levels in the lower back that branch out off the spinal cord through the hip and the buttock area and then they give rise to the sciatic nerve which goes the rest of the way down the leg and so if people are struggling with this and they go to their doctor and have this leg pain and their doctor says well it's sciatica they might give them some medications or instruct them to go to physical therapy but if they're not getting the results that they're looking for you know it might be worth a second look to get more of an accurate diagnosis and really determine which of those five nerve levels are irritated what's actually irritating those nerves and if you can figure that out then it's going to be much easier to come up with a solution to get it fixed but there's many different causes to that um, you know even you had mentioned like sometimes during pregnancy right. changes with that women can get sciatica the most common cause is usually a bulging or herniated disc in the back so although it's a leg pain or a leg problem that could be shooting pain or numbness and, and tingling or even weakness it's a problem that actually originates in the lower back yeah, it is interesting. I know I was sharing with you that I remember when I was pregnant, that was one of the things that developed, especially during my second and third trimesters as I, the baby was getting bigger mm -hmm. and that's because there was that pressure. Yeah, and that's really what it is. You know, people always say pinch nerve, but it could just be irritation of the nerve. It could be inflammation in the area. But when the discs degenerate or start bulging into those nerves, it can certainly cause those symptoms as well. Yeah, and so then we talk about the treatment <clears> options <throat> for that. And you really have successfully been able to help a lot of people without having to resort to resort to anything that would be really invasive. Exactly and we know people are frustrated with that. They don't want to have to take drugs the rest of their lives. They don't want to have to keep getting shots every couple weeks or months. I don't know too many people that want neck or back surgery. So we actually offer non-invasive solutions. A lot of our treatments actually fix the cause of these symptoms that cause pain. We're not just trying to mask it temporarily and that's a big reason why our patients get really good results and long-lasting relief because we help their spines get healthier. Yeah, the decompression machine that you have, the um, the DRX 9000, that is really, it really is a great solution for this. It is, Terry, and this is not a type of chiropractic adjustment. This is actually a medical device that helps to heal and regenerate those injured discs. So computers uh, assist with the treatment, uh, but patients just gently relax on their back and they're comfortable, and we can pinpoint the specific level that's irritating the nerve, and it's just a very gentle stretch. A lot of patients are surprised at how gentle it is. You know, they come in thinking that's going to be pulling really strong, um, but it's a gentle stretch, and as you can see, on the uh, video here those bulges are actually able to be retracted in off of the nerves and moisture and nutrients are drawn in those discs so they start to regenerate the pressure comes off the nerves and it provides a solution for that back pain or the sciatica pain yeah and you talk about often how the body mm -hmm. just is able to heal itself because you allow that material to get infused back into that troublesome area yeah and, and patients are happy with that you know they want to live life their life and a lot a lot of people struggle doing the daily functions with these problems. Um, not a whole lot of enjoyment in their life, even just things we take for granted. Walking any length of time, just getting dressed in the morning, right. bathing, you know, getting shoes and socks on is a real struggle. And so to help these patients get their back healthier, it's just a great thing to see. You know, they're very happy about that to just go live a normal life once again. Right, exactly. And so you have a lot of patients who have had great success. We're talking about Cheryl now. Let's talk about exactly how you were able to help her. So Cheryl, uh, her main goal is she really enjoyed traveling. And so with the traveling she wanted to do, there's going to be a lot of walking involved to different sites. And she had uh, sciatica pain as well in her low back and her leg and that was causing these limitations and as we consulted and started to do an exam get imaging um, we determined that she had some of these problems in her lower back and she was actually a great candidate for a decompression program and uh, we put her through that and she did very well and she's off traveling and, <laughs> and doing these trips once again that sounds great now how about Gary 
Gary uh, is a very active man. He owns a hardware store, and uh, he was not smiling like this when I first saw him. He was uh, really struggling and hurting with the back and the leg pain, and not only did it affect his work, but he couldn't sleep at night very well because he was in so much pain, and you know, losing that necessary sleep really affected him each day, and it wasn't just about work for him either. He wanted to enjoy his wife and his grandkids, and that was struggling, so you know, by getting that problem fixed with our decompression program. He's working full time again and having fun with the grandkids that, and the family. That is great. And a great place to start really is by attending one of your seminars because I know you offer a lot of great information. You allow people to come into your uh, beautiful office and really get a chance to see all of this. Yeah, this is going to be Tuesday, February 25th at 6 p.m. Uh, and I'm going to be doing this seminar. It's free. There's no obligation. You're welcome to bring a guest with you. Um, but we do fill up, so make sure to call and get that scheduled. But it's a very informative seminar. I'm going to be talking about what are these different conditions conditions most people struggle with, including sciatica and some of those other conditions I mentioned earlier. And then we're going to talk about a lot of common treatments that are recommended. And I'll even cover some things that we don't do in our office, but we'll really educate uh, the group on what these treatments are, pros and cons. And my goal is just to help educate them enough that maybe it steers them in the direction they need to go to get the relief they're looking for. And if people can't make it, should they call this number to get your special? Yeah, so for uh, $99, we do a consultation, the thorough exam, and also report of findings. And we have a special, it's our 16-year anniversary, so for, uh, we're going to be doing $16 x-rays to the first five callers. I did want to make a point that we do work with insurances, but if they don't have insurance or it's not covering these things, it's a great special to take advantage of to start getting the help they're looking for. Yeah, and you have a great team in your office who will help people sort yeah. out those insurance uh, specifics. Absolutely. Thanks so much, Dr. Miller. Thank you, Terry. And stay right there. More of 8 West when we come back. Don't go away.